Hello, I am Nitesh Pran from Lab and Multisim. Someone asked me how I can count how many digits are present on my numbers. I mean he wants to count a digit from an integer. So that's why uh, I have one small solutions which I am going to show you. If you found it is uh, important for you so you can use it. Right click, come here, take a numeric control. Right click. Come here, come into the representation, I32, right click, right click, come here, come, come to the create, property node, numeric text, label, okay, text. right click come here string string length make a connections count 1 free ok free right it's 4 so here I need one beautiful I need one more concepts If my number will be less than equal to zero, if my number will be less than equal to zero, yes, if my if my number will be less than equal to zero, show what should I do? So I will use this decrement function. If my number is less than equal to zero, so I will use the decrement functions. And what I will do? I will do this one right click come here take a select functions make a connection like this if my number is less than equal to 0 so I will use ok you can use this logic If your number okay, if my number is not less than equal to zero, so I will go with this. Now, Control B. So because I only want to measure how the number of digit, okay? If because I only want to measure the number of digit. Okay, for better programming, I am trying to use, I will try to use first what? Flat. So, take this number here, inside flat, right click, here, right click, then take here, then right click add frame after drag the function here Okay, so you can design and you can count how many elements or how many digits are present on my number. So thank you for watching this video.